channel um, this is number three of my glam series and honestly this is probably my favorite 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 look because I think it's more of like a classic Christmas look and I only say that because this is probably what I do every single Christmas I do like gold glitter lids and like a dark lip but um yeah I tried to be I tried to make this as easy as I could the glitter that I used it is a little bit pricier but I am gonna list a cheaper version on the description box so make sure to check that out but yeah I mean oh my god I totally forgot I hit 100 subscribers ah! Can you freaking believe that? I don't know. I can't. I still can't believe it. Like, look, I can't stop smiling. I'm so excited. Um, but yeah, thank you. But either way, I, I think I'm just rambling right now. <laughs> so let's just get on with the video. I really hope you guys like it. If you give it a try or if you want to see anything else from me, don't forget to go ahead and let me know in the comments down below. So if you want to learn how to get this classic holiday look, go ahead and keep on watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Alright guys, so I already did my foundation and I'm baking right now. How crazy do I look right now? It's like you're going into the, the final look, you know, at the introduction and then it cuts to like me just here with like my bakage. Okay, so I've already done my foundation. I already, I already did everything else. So now I'm just baking. I did my foundation the exact same way I did it on my first video. Um, yeah, the only thing that changed is that I primed with my baby skin instead of my Magic Lumi. I primed with my baby skin. It's I've been reaching for this primer a lot lately. I'm not sure why. I've had it forever. I've just never used it a lot. But I've been using it a lot lately. I think I think I like it so far. Anyway, all right. So I'm gonna put you guys in closer so we can start on our eyes. <clears throat> all right. I'm gonna go in with my Too Faced Shadow Insurance Primer, and I'm just gonna put a little dollop on my eye and blend it out with my pinky finger or any finger. I think all fingers work the same. Smashbox full ex blah, 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 blah. And today we are going to be using the Smashbox full exposure palette and it looks like this Ooh. This one's actually um, Broken, you know, but either way we are going to use this palette today and I wanted to do more of a um, like a classic holiday glam which is mostly like gold eyelids and a berry lip or like a deep dark lip so that's what I'm going for today um, I did not plan this out I'm kind of just gonna wing it and see what I come up with but I really wanted to do something that was gonna be easy you know because I feel like uh, my last look was a little bit no my look my first holiday glam was a little bit difficult so <clears throat> I'm gonna my last one was kind of easy so this time I'm gonna try and do something a little bit easier for you guys mm. I'm going to take my Morphe R40 brush, which is just a fluffy brush, and I'm going to go in with this lighter shade right here. No, actually, I think I'm going to go with this one. And I'm just going to use that shade just to set my entire eyelid. Reason why I set my eyelids, it's only because I feel like it helps a lot whenever you go in uh, with a brush and try to blend um, your shadows out. I'm going to go in with my Morphe R38 brush. And I am going to take this shade right here, which is the deeper tone, this one right here. And this is going to go right on my crease. So I'm going back in with my Morphe R40 brush and I'm just going to diffuse all of that together. This is the brush that I use to apply my the first color. And I'm just going to use it just to blend everything together. Don't worry if you get it too much on your brow bone. We are going to go back and apply some highlight there. That way it looks a bit nicer. Then after that, I'm going to go in with my Morphe M330 brush. <clears throat> and I'm going to go in with the deeper shade, which is this one right here. And I'm going to apply that on my outer corner. Gonna 
going with a flat brush. Any flat brush will do. I'm going to take one from my eBay set. And I'm going to spray it with some Fix Plus. I personally just have Fix Plus right now, but you can use basically any setting spray that you'd like. So spray that with a little bit of Fix Plus, and we are going to go in with... Let me, let me swatch them first, see which one I like better. Alright, we are going to go in with this lighter gold shape right there. And this is going to go all over the lid. brown and we are just going to diffuse the edges on that just a little bit because we kind of want it to be a little bit more shiny and more glittery so you do not have to go back in with a lot of product just enough to diffuse the edges <laughs> back in with my Morphe R40 brush and I'm just going to use it just to blend everything together. I wanted it to be a lot brighter than this and since it's not I'm going to go in with some glitter. So I'm going to be using Urban Decay Heavy Matter Glitter Liner in the color Midnight Cowboy and I actually just got this in the mail. I'm excited to use it. All right. It looks like that and it's oh <laughs> it looks like that and it's called Midnight Cowboy. Alright, so we're just gonna take that glitter and we're just gonna go over the gold. Ever so So once you're done with that, you're going to take any fluffy brush and you're just going to brush off your bakage. I'm going to take my, the same brush, my favorite brush up. I'm going to set my eyebrows using my Brow Drama by Maybelline. So we're just going to go in with our Morphe M508 brush and we're going to take the darker brown and we're just going to put that right on the outer corner in our lash, no, in our waterline. Sorry guys, <clears throat> I'm not even sick, I don't know why. But I did just wake up, that's probably why my voice is so raspy. Anyway, so I'm gonna go in with my little fan brush and I'm gonna take my e.l.f. compact with my contour, my St. Lucia bronzer right there. 
And I'm just gonna bronze up all my face. Oh, I got something in my ear. Oh my god, I didn't even make my bed for this video. Oh, I'm such a mess this morning. It's just that it's a week before Christmas. And I'm just, you know, I think everyone gets stressed out a week before Christmas, so maybe that's just me. But yeah, it's been a tough week. Alright, so we're just gonna cut it. I'm happy with that. And then we're gonna go in with our Luminoso. I will never stop wearing this, honestly. If there's something that you should buy from this, it's, it's Luminoso. Just a little bit. And then we are gonna go in with our with our Makeup Geek Kathleen Lights palette uh, in the color Night Light, which is that one, which you can obviously tell that it's my favorite. And I'm gonna do that as a highlight. I'm pretty happy with that. It's not a lot, but you know, it's something. All right, so now I'm gonna go in with some mascara on my on my bottom lashes, and then I'm gonna line it with my Rimmel London uh, eyeliner in nude. All right, and then after that, I'm just gonna go in with my pinky finger and a little bit more of that highlight, and I'm just gonna apply that to my water. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna apply that to my inner corner. So all I did, I just went ahead and also popped some highlight on my brow bone. And uh, what else did I do? Oh, and I put some of that darker shade just right in the outer corner just so I can meet the eyeliner. Sorry guys, that's my mom. Alright, and then I'm gonna go in with my NYX pencil in New Truffle. And I'm just gonna line my entire lips. just a lot all right so you're gonna go in with your milani i bought this um at walmart and it's in the color cabaret 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 blend and it's in the shade number 40 and it's a milani lipstick it looks like that and the shade it's really pretty it's like a dark wine color so i don't have any lip liners that look like this that's why i went ahead and chose a brown one hopefully it looks good let's find out of our glam series i hope to take out at least one more before christmas hopefully by friday i'll take out another one which is my birthday i'll probably even do my birthday makeup but um either way i really hope you guys like this look if you do give it a try or if you want to see anything else don't forget that you can always comment down below and i'll go ahead and get it up for you guys i did get a request to do the hair that i did on my glam on my holiday glam episode one so i did work on that video for you i will probably post it up after christmas you know after i'm done with my holiday glam but as of right now um i don't have anything else to tell you guys except uh thank you so much i mean just for watching me just for liking the video thank you to everyone that's sharing I, i'm just very very thankful that you guys take 20 minutes out of your day just to watch me put on makeup that's freaking amazing to me so thank you thank you thank you thank you so much just for watching for liking for subscribing and for commenting you guys are freaking amazing you guys are awesome and thank you so much come be my friend and follow me on all my social medias i did post them down in the description box below and everything i use today will also be posted down there for you guys um and i think that's it for today so either way thank you so much for watching honestly million kisses to you thank you so 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 much for watching and i really hope you like this video and either way i will see you in my next video and i will talk to you guys later bye 
Bye. Bye. <laughs> I sounded like a freaking llama. Wait, do llamas even make that noise? No, I think it's like sheep. Yeah, I think it's sheep. <laughs>